Welcome, everybody. It's the first Friday of the month again. It's the first of July, so even the first day of the month. And it's already time for a new episode or new yeah, episode of the, the Flower Circus online show. I don't know which one it is. I think we're already over 30 online shows today. It's uh, nice weather outside in Holland, at least for now. And uh, we have summer vibes uh, today because it's summer. And we got uh, Geertje with us today, who's going to show us a lot of beautiful summer designs. So I can't wait to see I made seven different designs. So uh, let's quickly gather into the live stream. <laughs> and she can't wait. She's already shouting <laughs> everything. So, uh, Hello. There she is. Geertje, welcome. Nice thank to you. see you again. Sorry? Nice to see you again. I mean, it's... Yeah, thank you. Yeah. It's been a while. You've been... Uh, I'm back again. Yeah, you've been to Belgium with Flower Circus. Did a great show over there. So uh, great, uh, it was a great experience. Yeah, what are you gonna make? Uh, first, I started with I uh, will make a summer uh, summer arrangements. Yeah. And this is uh, a nice uh, uh, a combination with uh, cups and. Uh, oh. Well, John. Same colors. Thank you, John. Please don't put that one on uh, on mute. Otherwise, we can't hear uh, Geertje. <laughs> But now it works. So <laughs> okay, has... it works. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh, Geertje, yeah, I also want to welcome everybody that's uh, that's already watching. Please let us know where you're from in the comments or if you have any questions for Geertje. Uh, she's making uh, a lot of nice designs today. We're upcycling as well, as you, as you can already see. You can see some paper cups over there. Yeah. I glued it on a, a, a wooden plate. And uh, all the cups are different, have been made, uh, covered with different uh, 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 paints. Yeah. And uh, yeah, for the summer, uh, that I used uh, some shells, diff two different kinds. Welcome, John, by the way. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Did you go to the hair? Did you go to the hairdresser, John? I miss your wig. Yeah. And he did my hair as well. Okay. <laughs> So how, how did you attach the, 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 the cups to the, to the wooden? Yeah, with some hot glue. Okay. And it's very, uh, well, you can see. Very firm. Yes. And you can make it all the different shapes. Now it's a long table uh, design, but you can also make uh, some, uh, this is small pieces. And I use only two different uh, flowers, two different colors of uh, these shelters. Yeah. And I think that's enough because then you see the, oh, the whole uh, base and, and the flowers. Yeah. Koen van Walderen is watching. He's saying hello, John, two times, and uh, Geertje. Uh, welcome, Koen. Hi. Uh, see that you're online as well. So, and we got uh, two types of, uh, of Lysianthus there. We've got, uh, as we can see, I think it's the Alyssa White. Let me see if I got a nice picture of that one as well. Yeah, there it is. A beautiful Alyssa White. And the Lysianthus Pink is there as well. And maybe, uh, John, you can, uh, you can uh, show a detail of the Lysianthus Pink. But John is not there. John is uh, already, he made enough hours today. <laughs> Sally is in saying, Hel hello, you all magical people from Berkshire, UK. Sally, thank you for uh, joining the show. Marcella Fleur is saying hello from Manchester. Hi. The pink variety. Yeah. <laughs> yes, please, John. And one second, and I will show it as well. There we are. It's both the Alyssa and the Lisanna. Look at the size of the flowers. They're really big. And we're again after the last show where we've been this at... This is the, my thumb. Where's your, I don't see your thumb. Oh, there it is. It's a bit... Uh, I don't know what you did with your thumb, uh, John, but it looked... <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It looked a bit strange. Oh. Well, this was almost finished. Okay. Now, this is, uh, you can use this for a, a, a wedding or uh, in a restaurant, a beach club, on a table. 
I think the beach club is with the shells. Yeah. Yeah, that's a great combination. Uh, Julie is uh, joining us as well. Oh. Julie Walling is saying, yeah, hi everyone from UK. Then we got uh, Marije Soetekouw in. Hello from Heerenveen. Oh. Oh. You know that? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so the neighbor is watching oh, as well. Uh, Tineke is in as well saying, hey Geertje, long time no see. Oh, Which was weer prachtig. Oh, it's, it's still nice to see each other uh, in this way as well, online. You see, uh, after the COVID or, uh, yeah, that we couldn't travel or the, now we still are so busy as, as flower designers that <laughs> we still can't see each other or don't have the time to see each other because everybody's flying all over the world. It's really nice. It's a compact composition. And uh, the... The wood is floating a bit as well from the table. So you, yeah. have, you have something underneath it as well. Yeah, there's some uh, wood, the wood, yeah. Can you lift it? Yeah, the, of uh, course. Place? Oh my God, she is so strong. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Let me show it. Yep, there it is. And now this is a, a big one. We can also make a small one. <laughs> oh, this, this is the magic of uh, Geertje. Look, there it is. <laughs> Ta-da! Also for every budget, like uh, you see more with the Flower Circus show, can uh, can make different ones for a different budget. Uh, one second, John, so I will show it. There it is. Simple but very beautiful. Especially when you have a Chinese restaurant and turning plates. Yep. Yeah. Instead of the carrots in the middle. Then you're going to have the, the carrots in the Really nice. nice. After the show, we'll make some pictures and then uh, we'll make a lookbook uh, from all the, uh, the arrangement here you made. Well, more and more people are coming in. Preeti Sarda is in, saying hi from India. Uh, friend of the show, Ludmila is in, kisses from Minsk. Uh, Stephanie is in. Bonjour, uh, Dalby, en France. Monique Verbeek is in. Monique is saying uh, prachtig. So uh, yeah. already up to the next one. Geertje is, is flying today. Yeah, we have seven uh, pieces and I want to show it all. But uh, first, before you start working on this one and John is getting the, the flowers, uh, Geertje, tell me a little bit more about the construction, about the frame. Yeah, this frame is made from cups. And you normally use it for a uh, seed. Just the cultivation uh, pots. Oh wait! And I will, then I make a hole. One more time, then I will show it in the in the camera. Yeah, now we have it. I make a hole in. And then you see it through. Yeah. Yep. Now just with a stapler and attached together. And because oh. of the shapes of the cup, you get a really nice round frame as well. Yeah, you can they make a very nice shape. You can make it small, you can make it big. Oh, she's already detailed. You can make different shapes. I have make a round shape. You can also make a, a nice heart or... Oh, yeah. Yeah, no, no, not, not nervous, but it's very, you try. If John can even do it, then everybody can do it. Oh, oh. Let me see if John can do it. Yeah. <laughs> John is working on if it. Men Thank can you. Do it, women can do it as well. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Aimi, uh, you Sala is in as well. Yo Sala, hopefully I pronounce your name uh, right. Greetings from Estonia. The only Estonian word I know is two. That's the tax. So uh, no more Estonian uh, words for me. John, maybe you know some Estonian words. Estonian words. 
No. No? Okay. <laughs> Sorry. So. But you can see how quickly you can make a, a frame with those cultivation cuts. A few minutes, I make well, this construction. It's very light, easy and fast to make. John, and you can stop when now. When I was finished, you. I made a, a frame of some wire. Maybe you can show that, uh, John, how uh, the frame is attached to the cups. One second. Yeah, there we go. So the metal wire is attached to the cultivation, the cups. Yeah, also make some lines. And what type of wire is it? This is uh, this wire from Oasis. Okay. And now that's finished. The construction is finished. I do. Uh, yeah, I use some dry materials from the garden for my garden. Again, from the garden. This is the same. <laughs> Uh, Rich is spending a lot of time in her garden. Every time when I call her, she's in the yeah. garden doing something. And sometimes I catch her in the garden of the neighbor because then he has some nice greens that the, she wants to use. <laughs> Hopefully the neighbor isn't watching. No. Oh, one neighbor now, Mariah. Yeah. <laughs> Mariah, okay. sorry. Yeah, it was, it was yes. So uh, Aimi is saying... Uh, Tervisex. I don't know what it means, but uh, hopefully uh, Facebook and uh, and YouTube don't kick us out now. <laughs> I see some beautiful uh, Bouvardias there already. And uh, also the Deontes, the green ones. I think it will really help to, to pop out the colors of the, the Bouvardia. The Bouvardias from Griewijk. It's really worthwhile checking the uh, the website of Griewijk because they have so many different varieties. I'll try to uh, to show you some and also to show you the difference because there are double flowered and single flowered uh, Bouvardias. And for the people who think Bouvardia that's a flower only for weddings, forget it. It's a, a flower you can use in every arrangement now. The the vase life is uh, has improved a lot. That has to do with uh, the way. They grow the, the Bouvardia. It's a totally new way of growing Bouvardia. And let me show you some of the... I think this is one of my personal favorites. That's the, the Salmon. And as you can see, this is a double one. And then I'll we'll hide this one. And then there's the Pink Charm as well. Big flowers. And this is a single one. Um... Vicky Hees is saying, uh, love the idea of the, uh, using the pots for a base. Uh, Madeleine is in, saying, uh, bonjour, uh, Denise, Côte d'Azur, France. Probably also really nice weather over there. Uh, Marije is saying, uh, we hebben niet zoveel so planten om te gebruiken, ben ik bang. Uh, she doesn't have a lot of plants, maybe anymore. <laughs> Geertje already cut everything. <laughs> How's your relationship with the neighbors, uh, Geertje, so far? <laughs> oh, wait, I don't have any sound from you. Uh, let me check where it is. John, I think you need to connect again because I can't hear Geertje. Maybe in this way I can hear you. Geertje, can you? Yeah. No, uh, it's not that microphone. I've got another one. Moment, one, moment, one, moment, one moment, one moment, one moment, one moment, one moment. Waiting to join. Yeah, one Next second, camera. and we find John as well, so we can have the right yes, um, again. Again. One second, then I have to switch off the other sound. So, Geertje, can we try again? Sound check, one, two. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah. Yep. Okay. And now you can sing again. You can start one, singing. Two, three, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, yeah. eight. No, that's just in Dutch. <laughs> Hans Seilstra is saying, I love the Bouvardias. Hans made a really beautiful piece with Bouvardias as well last month. Uh, for the people who haven't seen the show, you can check it on, uh, on YouTube. 
Hans is saying as well, nice work, Geertje. Hi Hans. And I really like the design and all mixing the colors of the, the Bouvardias. I think this is nice because a lot of people still think Bouvardias is there in, in pink and white, but there are so many other colors, like I showed you the... Uh, one second, John. Yep, there we are. And I see the Naomi there as well. The rosa pink, the sparkles, salmon. So it really looks fantastic. Mixing up those colors. And I think the using the uh, the green balls of the Diantas really makes the other colors pop out. Vicky Hees is saying it's sunny here in Suffolk and I'm watching on my mobile and Will Wimbledon on television. So uh, busy times for Vicky there. <laughs> I don't think there's any Dutch uh, tennis players left at uh, Wimbledon because I think it's already the third round. Most of the time, the Dutch uh, players are already gone by then. But let us know, uh, Vicky, who's winning at Wim Wimbledon. Peertje, do, do you still play tennis? No, that was years, that was years ago. Yeah. <laughs> Monique is saying super mooi. Really nice. And especially the cups, they work really well. For the people who, who find it difficult to make a round bouquet, the cups will really help <laughs> because you already have the shape of the bouquet. Yeah, it's now easy to make. Yeah. Don't say that. Oh. It's very difficult to make. Oh. You have to be a very skilled designer to do such a thing. Okay, John. Oh, I no, think... it's quite easy. Even the clown can do it. Yeah, <laughs> you, you can try. Yeah. John? I'm not a clown. Oh, okay. <laughs> I think it, it works really way. well if, oh, if, if it's easy to make, but it looks a million dollars. That's the way you want to have it. Yeah. It's just like children. They're easy to make and they cost one hundred thousand yeah. dollars. Yeah. <laughs> Until they're eighteen. Yeah, and then it really starts counting. And then it really starts counting. Yeah. Tomorrow the first one of my family is going uh, on his own. Yeah. Yeah. So uh, finally so live in Amsterdam. Oh Sodom and Gomorrah of the Netherlands. <laughs> so there's a big party tonight at your place, Sid. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and and the whole village is waving him goodbye, uh, probably yeah. uh, tomorrow morning. <laughs> That's the first one. <laughs> yeah. Now the other five. <laughs> Sorry, four. Um. What makes the bouquet really special as well is that you can see the technique really well. Just below the cups, you can see the, the technique. So make sure you got your technique well as uh, right as well. Now you can see it. All the stems are pointing the, the same direction. And there it is. Yes. Really beautiful. Fabulous. Wow. Already Number two. Clean up. So Geertje is really flying and uh, while she's cleaning up her table, which is one of the most important things as well as a florist, just work clean. I just want to yeah. say that uh, next month we have another flower circus designer. We will have Stefan van Berlo. He is preparing for the European Championship, but he found some time as well to be uh, on the show next month. So uh, the first Friday of August, the 5th of August, we will have Stefan van Berlo as our uh, designer. And already up to the next one, Geertje. These flowers? These flowers, yes. Oh. Well, this is a, a, a frame of a, a base. I made also uh, uh, this base. These are all pieces of wood. 
uh, normally you go, you go do it, uh, it's garbage, but I use it for uh, the base. Uh, I uh, use some uh, glue for the woods and then uh, one night dry and then you have a nice base and it makes some holes in it with other uh, wooden pins. Uh, I use some glass tubes, also this rustic wire and uh, for uh, uh, summer... Uh, John, just for the purpose of... Yeah, we we'll just go a little bit higher. Oh, that's Lift better. Yeah. A yeah, great. Because the dragonflies were lifting up uh, the arrangement already. Yeah, I think this is very summer uh, when I see this. Uh, uh, Have you made them yourself with dragonflies? No, no. You bought them? I bought them, yeah. Just, so, a, quick, uh, just a quick update also. on... The, on Wim Wimbledon, Heather Watson uh, from the UK is winning so far on number one court. Uh, on Jabur, one set up on center court. Just for the people who are uh, also watching uh, Wimbledon. <laughs> Tiffany is saying, uh, Gaaf Geertje, tot zo. Tiffany is on the hey, way. Hey, Tiffany. Board. We've got uh, Farida Kalimin saying, uh, hi, everyone. Uh, Marije is saying, uh, wow, and so fast. Koen is saying a uh, nice structure and bouquet. That's from the, the previous bouquet there. So, and what's the flower you're using at the moment, uh, Geertje? The, yeah, I knew the, here is the aconitum. Yeah. And this, I was... Sorry? Sorry, I, don't, <laughs> I forgot. Did you just yeah, use or... the word? No, 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 no. Yeah, the, the flower word. The, flower. the flower world, yeah. Oh, <laughs> it's a shame. Second I'm sorry. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, I use also the chrysanthemum, the aconitum, yeah. the purple. I think I love the purple colors in the summer. The chrysanthemum, and, and we have a lot of uh, viewers from uh, from the UK. So uh, here we have the chrysanthemum Rosano Charlotte, named after the little princess Charlotte. Uh, they even uh, sponsored the foundation, uh, the, the Princess Charlotte Foundation. It's a beautiful one with the green edges. Oh it's God. not painted, so it almost looks like it's painted, but it's 100% natural. It's part of the Rosano family, so there are more colors available. And I don't know if I'm allowed to say, but there's a new color coming up. I think it will be half a year, year maybe, that it will come. So be on the lookout for a new color of Rosano. So Geertje, why are you taking off all the leaves? Uh, well, if you, uh, it's, uh, if you see the leaves, you, then you don't see the lines. And I love to see the lines. Then you make uh, the, the arrangement is stronger. And uh, I love the trans transparent, uh, transparent work. Yeah. Yeah, I love the naked flower. Yeah, I'm sorry. <laughs> flower. Okay. The naked flower. Right. <laughs> uh, Farida so saying so beautiful, uh, love no, it. It's just the flowers which are naked. Uh. Yeah. Uh, Vicky Hees is saying love that Princess Charlotte presentimum. I think it's uh, the favorite favorite of a lot of florists at the moment, uh, Vicky. Oh, okay. I'm not the only one. Yeah. Now you see the, the flower. Uh, yeah, I love the, 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 the colors. And then, yeah, you see more the colors, the more the shapes of the flower. Yeah, Anna is saying as well, Rosano is one of my favorite. Well, Vicky is asking, uh, did you make the dragonflies? Or no. did you buy them? I buy them. Okay. And did you buy them at a dollar store or a, a florist? Uh, a, a wall sale. Okay. It's probably child labor. <laughs> probably. <laughs> it's from Dutch children, so it's okay. Oh. Okay. <laughs> and the minimum wage just got up, so uh, it should be okay. And I love this uh, variety of uh, Bufalia, this little bit lila. Yeah. John, maybe you can have a detail of the Bufalia there. Yeah, I can. 
There we go. Okay. And it matches the aconitum, and I think that's why Geertje is loving the color. Yeah. yeah. Maybe we get them in focus as well, the Bouvardia, then we can really seal the color. But it's not on focus yet. Oh, sorry, but I have my glasses on. Uh, that's that's what we can see. We can see how you look at the flowers at the moment, uh, John. <laughs> <laughs> is yeah, it the so, focus now, uh, John? Yeah, the focus is right now. Now we can see it. Can you please hold your design, uh, Geertje? Yeah. Don't move too much, uh, Geertje. Yes. Yeah. Is there a reason that you just put the flowers in the top of the design instead of from the bottom to the top? Because all yeah, the flowers can, are pointing. You can also uh, do it uh, shorter, but I want to. Uh, yeah, but if you put it on the table, I have to stand on the table to look on the flowers. Well, this is a nice for a uh, uh, hotel yeah, on the lobby. On the yeah, no, on the ground, not on the ground, on the table. Small, a low table. Low table. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> a sort of Japanese dining yeah. table. Yeah. <laughs> we will also make some pictures later so you can uh, see the details there. But you can see what my point. Yeah. All the flowers are upwards. Mm -hmm. And it's quite tall design. But if you want to see the beauty, you have to look on top of the design. And that's not easy. Or am I nagging you? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, imagine? just be honest, Sure, yeah. Sure, yeah. Pete. Nag, nag, nag. My wife can do that. <laughs> <laughs> and my mother in law as well. <laughs> you can just hit him, Geertje, if you want. Yeah, but not with the base uh, of the. <laughs> <laughs> so, John, as you can see, she's making several layers there. Yeah. But that's because of my nagging about. <laughs> no, I don't in... say nothing anymore. Just, just be you're honest, just, you're just honest. impatient, no. John. Sorry, it was not finished yet. You're just impatient, uh, John. Oh, I was impatient, like like the the, the time with Michael, who all the, 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 in, in four of the six designs forgot one flower. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Every designer has a special thing, and that was the special thing for Michael during that yeah. show. <laughs> uh, Dimitri, a friend of the show, is in as well, saying good afternoon from Athens, Greece. Thank you for joining, uh, Dimitri. Uh, agree on one thing. One, they one hate second. To give me, uh, right. Right. Geertje, can you explain one more time how you made uh, the base? And John, can you uh, zoom in on the base? <laughs> <laughs> no. Well, the base is uh, uh, all you see all the uh, small uh, pieces of wood. Yeah. Normally, uh, this is uh, material that we uh, I, uh, throw away. Waste. But to waste. waste. To waste. And uh, all the uh, pieces I uh, yeah glue together. together with a uh, special uh, glue. glue? <laughs> 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 Then when it's dry, then I put some uh, here. Can I, can I show you? Oh, there we go. Yeah. yeah. So it's off the floor as well, or off the, the, the table. Yeah. So it's floating. And then I make some holes with, uh, with a drill, and uh, I uh, put some uh, wooden sticks in, and I'll uh, use glass tubes, and uh, some, I make some nice constructions of uh, this uh, rustic wire. Yeah. Uh, Julie, this is this is one of the things that Geertje, I think, is famous for, using a, a wooden base and then uh, the, the the tubes. Uh, if you see some other designs of Geertje during the previous shows, and every time she she surprises us again with making a little twist again on it, but it's really nice to see that it's uh, it's a bit her signature as well. Perfect. Finished. Yeah, finished. And there we go. You're welcome, Julie. Yeah. And then already up to, I think, number four already. So we're here. Uh, yeah. is really fast. She, I think she needs to go home. She still has a long drive uh, back home. <laughs> Two hours driving. Yeah. So, uh, and I want to let you all know that after this summer period, Flower Circus will be on the road again. 
just got some uh, some shows confirmed. We're gonna go to Norwich. We're gonna go to Montenegro. We're gonna be in France as well in uh, in September. So uh, just look at the website of Flower Circus, flowercircus.nl, and then you can see. Then probably we will be close to you as well for a, for a Flower Circus show live. And if you have a wholesale, or if you want to do a show with Flower Circus, uh, let us know. Send us an email or uh, let us know on, on social media. And then uh, up to the next one, the umbrella one. Yes. Now, I think this is very summer for summer. Uh, in Holland, we use this for uh, all the cocktails, the umbrellas. Uh, I have some here. Uh, where is uh, we know you got some cocktails there uh, hidden, uh, Geertje. That's where you get your inspiration from. <laughs> oh, the umbrellas you meant. <laughs> Yeah. Yes. And this is uh, the, the 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 base of this is a styrofoam uh, uh, part of a styrofoam ball. Yeah. Uh, that I glued it on on an uh, yeah. Maybe make some. Then you can see it. Yeah. It's just a wooden plate. Yeah. No, that's a sink. Sink. Plate. Okay. And uh, then I use uh, uh, Oasis Red inside. And also here inside the, the red, I use also the umbrella umbrellas. And then I make oh, I want a colorful arrangement and I make some. Uh, I use uh, uh, now the uh, nice spray roses, different colors, also the Diantes. Yeah. Uh... Anna, she probably saw the stories on, um, on Instagram and Facebook. She is saying, oh, I was waiting for this one with cocktail oh. umbrellas. <laughs> Looks so cool. So uh, if you are not connected with us on, uh, on Instagram, uh, please connect as well. Then you can see some sneak previews sometimes of what we're doing, uh, the, what we're preparing during the shows as well. Well, very nice. This is the base. I made it with my son together in the garden so this week. Again, child labor. Yeah. <laughs> again, Sorry. child labor. It's <laughs> yeah. First, um, the fly, now the base. Yeah. Makes you wonder what happens next. What's the next? Uh... <laughs> And I want to show you uh, some of the varieties of the spray roses. I really like this one. It's called uh, Rush. It's from uh, Kwekerijde Opstal. It's the first time we have this one, uh, John. Yeah, it's a new one. But I like how, it, uh, how the yeah. color changes when it's opening. Yeah, it's absolutely fabulous. Yeah. The other one. Yeah. And the other one, of course, we used it last month as well, the Mimi Eden. With the dark uh, center. We have that. <laughs> oh, John, John. <laughs> and maroon. And maroon is special because it's special because it's a beautiful rose, but also the shape of the rose. It's almost round. But some really beautiful roses from the Opstal. And uh, spray roses now, it's really the season as well, just because of all the weddings going on. So uh, they are really busy at the moment at, uh, at the Opstal, but they're making fantastic quality. The weather is nice, so uh, check also their website because uh, they have more than only the, the four varieties that we're showing today. It's about 21 varieties there, John. Uh, I think 24 or something. And the quality is exceptional. It's unbelievable how many flowers there are on one stem. Yeah. yeah. The whole design is made with just three roses. Yeah, almost. Almost. This is one. And this is almost a bouquet on itself. It's, it's, it's like the Lucrezia Last time we were here, we counted one of these stems, and it had over 16 up to 20 flowers on one stem. The spray roses or the Lysiantes? Lysiantes, but we also have spray roses with a lot of... Melissa Smedes is watching as well. She's saying, hoi Geertje. Hey, oh, Melissa. That's the other neighbor, Geertje. 
Melissa, is, uh, two weeks ago we were working together on a nice, uh, very nice project. Okay. So tell us more. I mean, you say Plantion nice. Plantion in uh, Ede. Okay, the, the auction. Yeah. And what were you doing at the Plantion? We're making a nice project with, with summer flowers. Summer or sunflowers? Summer flowers. Okay. Flowers that you see in the summer, John. Oh, well, I thought sunflowers were also uh, in the summer. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what's wrong. I don't. I think he forgot his pills uh, during lunch. Too much sun for him last yeah. days. Prison, so you, you can imagine what happened. <laughs> <laughs> one child is getting out in the one. No, 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 no. But going back to how many flowers there are on one stem. I mean, this is why we use those growers. This is why we use Luchlisiantes. This is why we use the Opstal as well. So to cover the area with uh, the floral foam, it's way easier just with one stem. And if you buy the different quality, maybe uh, the price is a little bit less, but you will never cover the area you do with good quality, like from Van der Lucht, like from Opstal, but also the Bouvardias, the flowers of the Bouvardias from Griewijk are much bigger. So also just take in mind, if you make something, if you make a commercial bouquet, it's worthwhile buying uh, more expensive flowers because they give you much more volume. So you need less stems. And there's not a lot of consumers that are counting stems. Just keep it in mind. Well said, Mr. Helsley. Thank you, uh, Mr. Koopman. John. Thank you, John. <laughs> Koopman, John Koopman, 00. Uh, out of the, uh, yeah. And again, I, of course, you probably already noticed, but we are at uh, the Experience Center of uh, Luchtlisiantes again. But, uh, and Yolanda is there as well. Thank you for, uh, for having us again, uh, Yolanda. Oh, and there's, that's not Yolanda, that's John <laughs> running. <laughs> <laughs> oh, she's waving <laughs> one second. Yeah, there she is. <laughs> she's really happy that she's uh, behind the camera normally. But, uh, she can uh, see uh, the girls uh, come on her as well because it's a great experience center. A lot of things are coming up uh, in the experience center as well. Uh, Geertje, if I'm correct, you will be with Flora Fundamentals in two weeks. Yeah, yeah two weeks, uh, about two weeks now. No, two days, two weeks. Then uh, we have a lot of meeting here with the Flora Fundamentals uh, ambassadors. Yeah, and a lot of courses are going on at uh, the Experience Center as well. So uh, check it out if you want to be creative and uh, you're close to, to the Westland. It's a very nice place to come to. And then you can directly see where those beautiful Lysiantas come from. How many umbrellas did you use, Geertje? I don't you used know. used more umbrellas than flowers, I think. 50-50, almost. Oh, 50 umbrellas and 50 flowers. No, yeah. yeah. <laughs> and some diplocyclos. Some what? Diplocyclos. Diplodocus. Diplocyclos. It's really nice to use. It gives it a special effect. Yeah. And that's about notes. Don't try. Don't try to eat them. They look better than they uh, than they taste. Let's make a detail of it. Yeah. This is. Show it to the camera, Kitsky. This is really sunny. This is really summer. Wow. Absolutely fabulous. Yeah, this is great. I had my thoughts before she started with it, but it looks stunning. It but looks... That's also good. Yeah, first you think what she, what she makes. You think it... I always have my thoughts with yeah. her designs, but when she finishes it up, it looks amazing. Yes. Vicky is so strong. 
Oh, I say, gaat goed? Ja. Yeah. John, just be careful. I want to take pictures of this beautiful arrangement as well. Oh! Oh, phew. <laughs> Monique's is saying, uh, wow, prachtig. So, uh, hopefully everything is still in one piece. And then uh, up to the next arrangement. Let's see uh, uh, what we have there. No, the small yes. one, yeah. While the, uh, the frame freezes, I uh, see Geertje just standing there and uh, nothing's happening. Oh, there she is again, yep. So, what's, what did hmm. you do there? <laughs> This one, uh, this? Yeah, this 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 uh, were two phases. They were damaged, uh, and uh, yeah, you can uh, go to the garbage, but you can also cover it with a uh, dry material. And then, the damage on the, 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 the bottom. Now, the bottom is okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Bottoms up. Yeah. <laughs> like I told you, Gage, you can hit them if you want. <laughs> Maybe I need to explain. That is. Geert is using a damaged vase because Geertje, together with John, they were in uh, in Belgium, and I think uh, John was a bit annoying, so she hit him with one of the vases. That's why uh, John is a little bit uh, how he is at the moment, <laughs> and Geertje found a way to still use the vase again. <laughs> It was the most stunning location we have yeah. ever did yeah. a uh, uh, demonstration. Yeah, I agree. Do you have a picture of that? Uh, if you start telling that? about it, uh, John, then I will try to find a picture. I can send you. Oh no, I cannot send you a picture from my phone because it's usually scanned. Let try me use see if I can find it. Picture, yeah, people who haven't seen it, they have to see it. Yeah, if oh, it's you... already nice now. No, it is. <laughs> John, don't play tricks with Geertje. No, no, no. Oh. Because she's using the same materials as she did in uh, Antwerp. Yeah. And, uh, one of the visitors, they were amazed by the. Uh, this, I'm not sure what it is, but it's. Dry material. Dry natural. <laughs> Almost sounds like a uh, drink. <laughs> <laughs> well, now I need to see if I can find a picture. The the stress is there. Now we can we, we can feel the tension, John. Yeah, it's the tension is very high, uh, John, at the moment. Let me see if it's uploading. It will take a while. Maybe, uh, the yeah. first day was a demonstration. We made a, uh, made a demonstration. And the second day there was uh, yeah, uh, with a yeah. yeah. How do you call that? Uh, yeah, hot culture show. show. <laughs> <laughs> with flowers. With flowers and, and flower designs. Yeah. People and a catwalk and lights. Oh, I can't find Music. a picture right now, but it, it, it will take a while. Uh, let's continue with the show and I will post some uh, pictures later. We already have, have, have posted some pictures. Yeah, we already posted some pictures. It was uh, a very historical building in the, in the center of uh, Antwerp. Yeah. I think the building was 150 years old, John. I think it was 2050 years old, or approximately. Okay. It was built before <laughs> Jesus was born. Okay. Almost. So, uh, Geertje, if you hit him with a vase next time, hit him harder. <laughs> Maybe something, something serious this. comes out yeah. of his mouth. You, you sure? <laughs> <laughs> now, it was about uh, uh, 150 years old. Yes, that's correct. And it was. Uh, uh, during World War II, it was damaged quite heavily, and it was rebuilt after that. And they did a splendid job. Yeah. They really did, yeah. Let me see if I can show you the chrysanthemum that's used at the moment. It's uh, a Rados cream. 
Rados green. Cream. Cream. I thought it was yellow. It's it's almost that's the, the uh, almost every time that's the discussion. It's uh, dark cream. Yeah, or light yellow. Yeah. <laughs> Sometimes when I sell flowers and they're not quite white because white is quite particular, uh, uh, and, and we sell cream as white as well. So it's same with pink. You can sell them as yellow. So the same as yellow. You can sell them as yellow. You can sell them as white. Yeah. Just when there's a lack of yellow, you will say it's ye light yellow. Yeah. Light yellow. Yeah. If yellow is expensive, they're yellow. <laughs> I really like the designs and using those vases again, discovering this is, this is really yellow. That's uh, limoncello. Yeah, the limoncello. It's in the work, limon yellow. Almost, yeah. If you drink enough limoncello, you will pronounce it like limon yellow. <laughs> well. I finished the bottle of limoncello last weekend. Uh, I've got no doubt about that, uh, John. <laughs> After well. I finished four gin and tonics, two bottles of white wine, and a cup of black coffee. <laughs> and, half and, then we're not, and then we're not even talking about the food that you no, eat. No, 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 yeah. no. It was about uh, <laughs> half, half a cow and, uh, and the wreck of a deer. Yeah. I can send you a picture from that as well. <laughs> yeah, please don't do so. No, no, it looked quite nice. It was uh, made on a large Kamado uh, barbecue. It's, it's, it's good that you're not from certain countries where they try to buy your daughter with three cows, uh, a, a pig, oh, and you already <laughs> sold two chickens <laughs> because you <laughs> ate it in one night. <laughs> <laughs> I once offered it to an Arabian guy. Yeah. yeah, but it was only dinner for, for two nights for you. <laughs> <laughs> and breakfast the morning after. Yeah, <laughs> the leftovers. The leftovers. <laughs> Marije is asking, uh, who ate the paarse bloemen? Heel mooi. So, Geertje, what's the name of the purple flower? Aconitum. Aconitum. Agapanthus. Agapanthus. And in English? Because Agapanthus is Latin. Agapantus, Agapantus. I also used Agapantus. Yeah. Maria, all the names that we're using uh, are in Latin. That's why we can uh, talk with each other uh, worldwide as florists, because everybody knows what flowers we're talking about. That's because Linnaeus... Well, now, now we get some history lesson. Yeah, history lesson as well. Linnaeus came up with all the Latin names. Is that correct, Jolanda? Uh, no. She has no... And where did Linnaeus come from, John? From Lisset. Holland. You sure? He was a Dutch guy. Linnaeus was a Dutch guy. Yep. If it ain't Dutch, it ain't much. <laughs> Which one? This one. The large one. The eye catcher. Now we're going to move yeah. some, uh, some things around, I think. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Oh. Yeah, take your time. Yeah. And there we go. Oh, and now we already directly see the lim limoncello. I'm going to lift the camera once again. Yeah. The only way is up. The only way is up. I think yeah, it's we... stable. Yeah, it's stable. I'm not sure, oh. but I'm putting it into the middle because it's about the design here. It's not about you. Oh! <laughs> it's when they say uh, somebody punishes directly. <laughs> uh, one uh, second. If you look at the inside, it's, it's, it's already amazing. And I'm making compliment, a compliment again because when I first saw the base, I say, oh, it's again with dead materials. But she's made a hell of a job filling it up with all these beautiful colors and color combinations. 
And now she's yeah. finishing it up with the limoncello. And Lysiantus. And Lysiantus. And, and spray roses. roses. Yeah. Tell us more about the bass uh, first, uh, Geertje. Uh, this is also a styrofoam ball. Yeah. Half part. And uh, there I uh, make, uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> okay. We <laughs> make a scale for the oasis. And in, at the top, oh yeah, first I cover it with uh, handmade paper. Yeah. And I, uh, for uh, the height, I use some uh, wooden sticks and also dry, uh, dry leaves. And not, uh, also you see some holes. I think that's, you can see the flowers better. Not the whole, uh, the whole uh, base. I made some wood sticks, but sort also, of yeah, sick, yeah, that's a good. Uh, and also I use some nice uh, skeleton leaves, the same colors of the flowers. And inside make uh, a lot of uh, uh, compact, do some compact, uh, compact uh, with, oh, wait a minute. I use flowers very compact and then I make uh, at the uh, top, I use some uh, flowers uh, long. I call myself. <laughs> okay. Uh, Anna, a little so bit echo. Looks promising. Uh, just some news from Wimbledon. Heather Watson is saying, oh no, uh, Vicky is saying Heather Watson won and she's through to the fourth round. Congratulations. And Keith, are you back again? Yeah, there's a little bit of an echo I can hear it as well. Hopefully the people at home uh, can't hear it as much as we can. And otherwise, uh, please complain in the comments. Behind the scenes. What are you doing, John? <laughs> I'm, I'm just filming behind the scene. Okay. So, Geert, she's yes. nervous already. She's more than nervous already, and then you're standing next to her. Yeah. But I've tested. I'm free of COVID. I think. A lot of different uh, flowers in there. We see the limoncello. Let me show a detail of the limoncello. Here it is. Bright, bright yellow. We were talking about uh, yellow and bright yellow. Now, this is really bright yellow. Nice round shape, the flowers. And there's the Alyssa yellow in it as well. Big flowers, maybe not as bright yellow, but I really compliment uh, the arrangement. And we have some spray roses in there as well. Let me see which variety that is. It's Pepita. And to make it not only not only summer, but even tropical, we have the the leaves there, and on top of the leaves, a little bit Hawaii. Hawaii. Yeah. Then we need to ask Yolanda if this is Hawaii. She's she's the expert on Hawaii now. Oh yeah. So Yolanda, is this a little bit uh, Hawaii? Bali. 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 Then Hawaii. Oh, okay. Oh. You see, if you travel the whole world, then you can even more colorful. Hendra Goud is saying the palms give a uh, contrast, lovely. As you can see during the preparation, Kitje started with one layer and now she is putting another layer on top. So a lot of things are happening in the designs. I think that's really nice. So you can keep on staring at it and every time you see something different, I love the color, uh, color combination. Yeah. The yellow and orange. A little bit soft pink. Turning plate on it helps a lot with making this arrangement. And we got uh, the Apricot Lysiantis. The 
have some Solosia in the arrangement as well. Do you know the, the English name or the Dutch name for it, uh, John? The Solosia? Uh, Hanekam. 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 It's in Dutch. And it's, it's a rooster's. Whatever it is. Sure. The rooster's haircut. <laughs> the rooster's haircut. Some even call it uh, monkey brains as well. Monkey brains. Just of the, the shape brains. of the flower. And especially with the uh, ah the, the coxcomb. That's how it's called. Hendra helps us. Thank you, Hendra. Coxcomb. Yeah. Sounds a little bit. Strange. Morgan is there as well. Morgan Douglas <laughs> Nut. Hello from London. Hi, Geertje. Sending laughs and hugs. Uh, fabulous designs as always. This one is also almost because, finished. Uh, Le Coq is in uh, French. But if I uh, see how it's spelled, it's the English Coq. So I'm not sure. Uh, Ah, uh, you're never, you're never sure, uh, John. Can you, can you give us a <laughs> Can you give us a detail of the uh, the cock stomp? the stelosia? We've been talking about it, so it's nice if you can uh, can show us a detail, Don't John. Don't have to shave tonight, uh, Gertje, because it's starting to. Uh, it's... Okay. Well, this is the last one. Got no idea what John is uh, talking about. Oh, John, can you uh, record? Oh, and I think I lost them both. So uh, if they can reconnect, that would be really nice. John, can you reconnect? Uh... I've got uh, one here, so I need uh, the laptop to be to be there. Okay. I'm going to, uh, Here we go. So, uh, we got it from a different different angle at the moment. Here we can see uh, the turning table, and Geertje is turning it around, so you can see it from uh, from every angle. And now I think we got John back in the stream again. Yeah, three, two, one. So we have a lot of people in the stream, so let me get out of it. Yep, yeah, there we are again. Um, I think if you uh, use the uh, 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 leaves, if you strip them until half. Yeah, you only. The same with what I do uh, with the other arrangements. Yeah, but because you have. You can still see the design inside because the, the, the uh, part of the leaves are still. Uh, is that a is, is that a smart thing? Mm, yeah. Sorry, once again. I'm, I'm not saying anything. It's, John, how yes. many? You did one show once. It's still on YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> I once was uh, rescued by. Uh, the Coast Guard in England, and that's a true story. And he said, always listen to your wife, because my wife called the Coast Guard. Oh. Yeah, and I, because I said, but, but she was standing over. Oh, yes. oh uh, hi. She was standing over here, but she, 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 I said, she's standing in the wrong place because women are always right. <laughs> but in this case, <laughs> Okay, so John once did a. I, I don't even remember the name of the of the show. He did something with lilies. The untied bouquet. The untied bouquet. You can find it on uh, yeah. on YouTube. Yeah, and it's uh, it's broadcasted by the Flower Council. Yeah, they still regret it, but anyway, <laughs> <laughs> I still get paid from the views each year. Yeah. So uh, he already got uh, two views uh, this year, but uh, yeah, it's it's like John is telling Geertje, number three of Holland, what to do. Yeah. 
Okay. 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 <laughs> so uh, we're moving everything a little bit because uh, we're going to get something special in as the, the last design quite curious what it's going to be there we go I can hear some sound already Morgan is saying see you soon uh, Vicky is saying superb So we got a dream catcher here. A floral dream catcher. A dream catcher. So let me see. How did you make it, uh, Geertje? Uh, this is a frame I bought with a wholesaler. And then I uh, used all uh, different colors of elastic. Make yeah. a little frame uh, for, the, for the flowers. Also use it uh, here with some shells and some uh, wooden uh, yeah, balls. Kraal, put a kraal in it. Uh. Beads. And I make, uh, so you use some round uh, glass tubes. Yeah, John, can you uh, zoom in a bit, please? Okay. So yes, I can. Hendra Gauss is saying, uh, wow, it's already finished. Uh, it's already, already almost finished. Yeah, almost finished. Almost finished. We can still see that some of the the tubes or the round tubes aren't filled up yet. We've got the uh, wow, the zembla lime there, and look at the contrast of the zembla lime, the green and the white. It's also it's 100% natural. We see a lot of painted chrysanthemums lately. Uh, I'm yeah. Some people like it. Some people hate it. But this one is 100% natural. And the fun thing is that the warmer it gets or the more sun it gets, the greener it gets as well. Normally colors fade away on chrysanthemums when it's really sunny. But this one, the color gets more intense. And I use very beautiful Nisiantas uh, also. Yeah, which one variety? Do you know the variety? Uh, yellow one. Alyssa yellow. Yeah. It's Alyssa yellow. And especially when you're using a design like this, then it's uh, good to use the Alyssa varieties because they got uh, huge flowers. Right. Did you, do you know the difference between the Alyssas and the Rositas, for instance? The, it's you got three groups in Lysiantus. You got the singles, the doubles, and then the fringed ones. So, John, what, do we, what did you want to know? This is a double fringed one. This is a double fringed. So, the, the Corelli and the Alyssa, that are the so double the... fringed ones. But if you want to know, there's the Lysiantus book. And maybe, John, can, uh, maybe John, you can show the Lysiantus book. There's a new Lysiantus book, wedding themed. And there's the difference, or you can see the whole assortment of all the Lysiantus. Yeah. Oh, there he is. Where are you? Where are you, John? Yeah, we are over here. Okay, I thought you had the Lysiantus book. The Lysiantus book? Yeah, you don't no, have the Lysi. Oh, they're so popular they're already sold out. No, they're not uh, sold out yet. You want okay. me to get a copy of the the Lysiantus book? Yeah. And the first one who reacts, we will send a copy of the Lysiantus book. So, uh, please, please uh, I, w I want a Lysiantus book. If you put it in the comments, the first one who reacts will uh, will get a copy of the, the Lysiantus book. We will ship it for you. And there he is, the one and only, my favorite assistant. With a copy of the wedding version. With the wedding version of the Lysiantus. I love the wedding bouquet that's uh, on the cover, made by, uh, by Tiffany, Tiffany van Lente. So, and 
Well, Geertje is finishing up her uh, dream catcher. So, Vicky, it's for you. She even says please. So, uh, Vicky, I will contact you uh, later. And uh, Hans, because you're number two, uh, we will get you a Lizzie Enters book. <laughs> <laughs> Again, too soon. Too soon. <laughs> Story of your life, uh, John. <laughs> it's even in your hair, uh, Geertje. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe in John's hair as well, but un no. pretty unlikely. Now the last one. The last flower. <laughs> 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 While her heart is beating oh, <laughs> very okay. fast oh, at the moment. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> Before Geertje finishes up uh, this beautiful uh, dream catcher, I want to say a big thank you to uh, Lucht Lysiantes for having us in their experience center and supplying uh, with their beautiful uh, Lysiantes, uh, the Opstal, for uh, supplying us with their uh, spray roses. Deli for chrysanthemum with their uh, chrysanthemums. And of course, uh, Grieweik as well with the Bouvardias. Hope you really enjoyed uh, the show. And on the 5th of August, we're back again with a new uh, online show. Uh, normally, we end with a bang. But uh, John, thank you so much. You finished uh, too soon again. So uh, this was it. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Hope to see you next time. And uh, stay safe. Bye-bye.